Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So there were a lot of people that were asking me for an update on the global top grossing situation on my streams yesterday and they basically wanted to know whether or not us global players can expect to receive top grossing rewards and more importantly top grossing stones for this new Namek Goku transformation celebration. Wait, what? Namek transforming Goku celebration and banner that just dropped on global and uh, as you guys know I always aim to please so here we go with the update video for you guys right now and as always we are on app Annie which is a great website that provides a lot of analytics and data for apps in the Google Play Store and the iOS store so we're gonna start here with the iOS store first as you can see we're on Dokkan Battle and we're sorted by iPhone by October 3rd, 2019, which was yesterday when the banner dropped, and also by top grossing. And if we scroll down just a little bit to the countries and regions and their rankings for top grossing, you will be happy to see that Hong Kong did manage to reach top grossing overall across the board. But before you get too excited, uh, hold on a minute, I'm gonna talk about the Google Play Store in a second, and uh, things are a little bit rough there right now. But we got Hong Kong at number one. We have France, which is very close at number two overall. They did hit top grossing number one in games, action games, and puzzle games. But unfortunately, if you guys didn't know, in order to qualify for top grossing rewards and top grossing stones, a country or region has to reach number one overall, not just in games, not just action games, but overall across all apps. And it seems like France did not manage to get there. They got very, very close. And when I looked at the actual apps that were ranked, it was some like podcast slash music player app that was above Dokkan in the France uh, iOS store. I'm not really sure what's going on with that, but uh, that is the situation right now. I cross-referenced across a few different websites and they all show the same thing to me. Uh, France is number two in the iOS store, at least for October 3rd. And if you go back a little bit to like October 2nd, for example, um, it's a lot worse because the banner hadn't dropped yet. So uh, we're not even looking at that. Let's go back to the third now. And yeah, as you can see, France is number two. Uh, I'm not saying that couldn't change. I'm not saying that they couldn't get to number one potentially in the next couple of days, but Here's the thing, uh, I think it's a little bit unlikely, mainly because our best chance of hitting top grossing number one overall is when the banner drops, the day it drops, because that's when most people will buy the stone packs and um, summon on the new banner, right? So even though it's possible we hit top grossing in France over the next couple of days in the iOS store, I don't think it's very likely. I'm just being honest. I, I don't wanna like put any false hope out there. You know, don't, I don't wanna give you guys any false hype. Uh, just to be completely straight with you, I think it's unlikely, but it could happen. It could happen. And then there's some other regions that are close, like uh, Belgium is at number three right now, uh, which kind of confuses me to be honest, because as far as I was aware, they had banned all loot boxes and also microtransactions in Belgium. So I'm not really sure how they're still being ranked here, but apparently they are number three. And uh, some other regions are number four, number five, number seven, number eight, and so on and so forth. Now those guys could once again hit top grossing, but I think it's unlikely at this point. Uh, but who knows, right? But at the very least, we do have Hong Kong at the moment at number one overall. So if they are at number one overall in the Google Play Store too, then that means we are guaranteed top grossing rewards. Let's pop over to the uh, Google Play Store here. And like I said, guys, things are a little bit rough on this side. They really are. Um, sort of by the same things, uh, top grossing, October 3rd, and we're just going by Android here uh, or Google Play. And it, France is currently at 12 in the Google Play Store, or at least on the third, they were at 12th. And uh, like I said, man, the, the third was when the banner dropped. So that was our best chance of hitting top grossing. Um, we also have Hong Kong at 50th, uh, Spain at 30th, Portugal at 17th. So essentially not a single country was able to hit top grossing, country or region was able to hit top grossing in the Google Play Store uh, the day that the banner came out. And as I said before, man, even though it's possible for the rankings to go up over the next couple days, 
it's not very likely because it's not like we're getting another banner after, right? It's just this one Namek transforming Goku banner. Even though it is a hype banner, I think the thing that really hampered the celebration and our chances of getting top grossing stones is the fact that the sales were really trash, man. We only got one 32 stone pack and a, um, I think, discount to three 91 stone packs, and that's it, right? Those are the only sales. And for that reason, because the sales were so bad, um, I think that's why we are struggling right now, man. Struggling a little bit. I mean, quite a bit, actually, in the top grossing department. Like I said, Hong Kong did hit top grossing in the uh, iOS store, but that's not enough to get us top grossing stones because a country or region does need to be top grossing in both the Google Play Store and the iOS store to qualify for top grossing and as far as you can see not a single country or region has managed to do that and while it would have been great for me to say in this video yo top grossing stones on the way guys it's gonna be awesome uh, free multis all that stuff I just can't do it I really can't as I said I don't want to give you guys false hope all right I want to give you guys the most accurate information possible and as far as I can tell based on the data that I was able to find we do not qualify for top grossing at the moment. Now there is a post on Reddit here um, by uh, one X Xavier. I think he just cross posted it. So the original post was by Red Red YT nine five three, and uh, as you can see, he said that. I mean, okay. One thing you want to notice is that his comment karma is negative eighty one. So that might tell you something. But he did say that uh, we hit top grossing in the iOS store and the Google Play store. But one very important thing to notice is that he's sorting by games and not overall. And like I said, you have to be top grossing overall to qualify for top grossing stones. And as you saw from the app Annie data, uh, France is number one or did hit number one overall for games, but number two for just all apps in general, right? So it doesn't count. It really doesn't count. And as far as the Google Play Store goes, I mean, they were even close, man. I don't know where he got the data for brands hitting top grossing number one overall for the uh, Google Play Store, but I mean, the best I can see here is number two for action games, number 11 for games, and number 12 for overall ranking for top grossing. So not even close, guys, not even close. Not a single country actually or region is close as far as the Google Play Store is concerned. So uh, yeah, as far as I can tell right now, I don't wanna say that the other person is lying per se, but I can't find the data to back up what he said. And uh, from what I can tell on App Annie, as well as a few other websites that I cross-referenced, at this point in time, like right now when I'm making this video, we cannot expect top grossing stones or top grossing rewards uh, in the near future. But as I've said, it's possible that things could change and uh, maybe France will hit top grossing in both you know, regions or uh, both stores at some point in the near future. But if I'm being completely honest with you, I think it's unlikely because the first day is our best chance. The first day when the banner drops is our best chance to reach it. And uh, we didn't manage to do it, which kind of sucks. It, it really does suck. So uh, that's the update for you guys. I, I'm sorry I couldn't give you better news, but I don't want to give you false news. I don't want to give you false hope. This is the most accurate information that I have available to me. And uh, I'm sorry if some of you guys are disappointed. I mean, obviously I'm disappointed too. I love free stones as any Dokkan player does but it doesn't look like we're gonna be getting them for this celebration, which, I mean, if you go by like past global celebrations, like for normal banners, um, it hasn't really been the case that we always get top grossing, right? We very rarely get top grossing for regular celebrations like this, and uh, usually only get them for super hype things like dual, dual Dokkan Fests, or like uh, there was an exception for the what was it the super saiyan like pure saiyans vegeta the transforming vegeta because that was like an extra hype thing that was a surprise but for the most part we don't usually get like top grossing for these banners that we know are coming and are by all means like regular celebrations right so i'm honestly not too surprised i mean i think some people were a little bit spoiled by the 300 million download celebration and the fact that we got so many top grossings for that 
But like I said, that is an anomaly. That is like a special case. And for the most part, Global doesn't generally get top grossing rewards for regular celebrations. So uh, there you go, guys. That is the update video that you guys asked for. And if more information comes out, like for example, if we do hit top grossing in both stores for a certain region or a certain country, then you know I will be back for an update video for that as well. But at this point in time, no top grossing rewards are expected, at least as far as I can tell. And that's how it is right now. So that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Hope you guys found it informative in some way. And as always, if you guys like the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. That's all I got to say. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.